see the trail from where I drove it up on here. Really? There's, there's, <laughs> there's puddles underneath here. Really? Like here and here. Damn. From where it was. It, I mean, you put your foot on the brake and it just squeezes. Yeah, no, you know, I drove it from Round Rock that way. Man, I was just hanging in there and pumping it. <laughs> see, this is. See, this is like a subfloor here. Okay, hold on, hold on, right. hold on. Here. Got it too, but it's not all the way through. What? What's the subfloor? See, this is a subfloor. Oh, that's a, okay. That's one outside of the floor. Okay. Yeah. Okay, and you're saying that that's the only one that's but, bad, but the floor. But see, good. this has got rust too. Okay, that's but it's not. It's not rust through. Okay. All right. Okay. You're also getting into the tubular framing now. So, I mean, cancer's cancer. Oh, I mean, rust is cancer, you know. You can't, once it gets that far, you don't stop it. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. So the brake lines, are these brake lines here? Or the brake lines, where they're bad, it's right here. Oh, I see. Back on top of that, that had fluid all coming right in here. Uh -huh. So I'm thinking probably the joints are right here where it goes into this tube. Yeah. They're rusting out. Do they go back to the back? The one? Yeah. Okay. Okay. What, what's this here? Is that the sub floor? This? This here. This is more your. This is sub, sub floor. floor. Okay. All right. Yeah. Okay. See, this is what's supposed to be where you can jack a van, the van up. It's cave plumb into the second floor once either somebody bottomed out or. But, oh, I see. So yeah. this is what you're supposed to. That's part of the original floor that you... Yeah, that's what you're supposed to jack the car up on. Oh, shit. Yeah. See, and it's just getting so far. I mean, yeah. I don't know how far it'll get in. Yeah. And, and to be honest with you, that's why I said... It, it, that's why I said 40 or 80 hours. Yeah. Because once you start tearing into it, yeah. uh, you don't know how much further it's going to go. And then you can't really... Like I said, it, it's... You can't stop it unless you cut it all out. What is that there, right there? That's that, that hole. That, that little part of the piece support? right here was no, a brace here. for this. And this? Yeah, all that. Oh, I see. It's a brace. Yeah. Oh, that brace is gone then. Yeah. 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 See? I, oh, I see. Okay. That was just the, that's a brace for the subfloor. Okay. And then back here, you you have the, uh, you say the brake. This is where the brake lines are in this channel here, right? This is right here. And then right here. It's your junction box. Right here is a real bad leak. It's oh. dried up now, but that's, oh, I see. that's where a bad leak is. Then right here, see where this bend yeah. is? Uh -huh. yeah. That's probably going to, that's that's on its way out too. Okay. And, and those the, these are lines are rubber. These are factory lines. You can replace these from here to the wheels. You can replace this little piece here. I doubt is factory. Those would have to be handmade, and the two here going to the front, those will have to be handmade too. I see. So that's what you were saying that. Yeah, has these to be are proportion. Custom? These are proportion valves. This is a junction box here. Okay, I see it. Oh shit, it's corroded the hell in it. I mean, and and you know, but like I said, it wasn't about a week ago. I noticed that the brakes were getting low. I even asked my son, "Did you feel the brakes being low?" He said. No, well, shit, they low on me. That's when I almost had a wreck on the freeway. Scared the shit. I thank God that I didn't, I didn't have someone driving yeah. it or. If, sell if it. it was just somebody that needed something for a little while, you know, um, I'd say put brake lines on and drive it. Yeah. But even the brake lines are going to run us some money. Yeah, that's a lot of hours. We got to get down to there, huh? yeah. and then it's got to be a mechanic. I guess, yeah, and in order to, once this comes down, there's probably enough room flex where you can get this out without because if you have to take the lines all loose this is ac lines and uh oh shit yeah ac lines oh that's quite, because the ac works in the back actually the ac lines are right here here's your ac lines oh, here. Oh, okay all right i see i see you know there's that damn gas filter i was wondering where that gas filter was because when I when I bought it, that's the first thing I want to do. I want to change that gas filter, and it's right, it's right there. Because it stopped only you know a couple of times, and I figured it just a. I guess, that's why I changed the starter. I put a new starter on it. Yeah. Here, just, here you're getting into the main frame. Yeah, right there. Back up here, it's the same way. It's all rusted on the main frame. Where's that? Back up in here. See that's your main frame on that side. Oh yeah. Right there. That's right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 
Okay. Well, you know, he was in New York for, I guess, from 203 to 213, I think, or 212, something like that. Hey, where's the start on this? Because I, I did put another starter. Where's on the motor here? Can I see it from the bottom? Because I, that's what that's what I put a new switch and a new starter. Can can you see it from here? It's right here. Where? Right there. They put in. There's a brand new starter in there. There it is. Okay, that's a brand new damn starter I put on there. Mm. Okay, that's what I want to say. Because I put the starter and I put and I, and I put the uh, a uh, ignition switch because it stopped on us on the way back from uh, from Houston. But. Yeah. You see, you got oil leaks all over the place. That's I mean, crazy. Crazy. there. Oh, that's that's trans, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean, it, 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 the trend works good, but yeah, I got the leaks. It is a two thousand, but the, the problem is the freaking rust. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, well, you, did you did you put together a, a, a yeah? A, a I wrote you up okay. a deal. So you okay. get these rotors are pretty ate up. Too. The rotors. Yeah. I don't know if those are turnable or not. All that rust on there. I'm surprised you don't have ABS lights on. I don't. I don't have any ABS. Yeah. So. It's got new yeah, struts. Right. It's got new front struts. And you know, the for other mechanic told me, he says, you mean they didn't tell him that, that, that it was that, that bad? He said, because they've got new struts. It's got a hell of a good ride. Well, I tell you, that's what I was telling you. Uh, you know, David, this would be a good one to take at the farm and throw the throw in the, <laughs> the hay. <laughs> They don't need any brakes. Put a drift brake on. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Hey, I'm going to turn it off, and I'll, I'll get that estimate from you.